Hello everyone and welcome back to the farm. Uh, this is vlog number 19, I believe. Uh, as you can see, I've just been down here and turned all the lights on because it's a dark winter's morning. Um, first thing we got to do is get these cows fed because they are eating a lot. So, as you see, we've got all our shiny machinery in here. We use the 6 free to um, feed the cows this morning. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys are all well. It's a it's a fairly chilly morning here on the farm. That's probably why the cows have eaten so much. I know they're completely almost out, so we will hot pick this on. I probably can wash this feeder wagon at some point as well, but our power washer is probably frozen over, so probably not this morning. We'll get the lights put on just so it's uh, easier for you lot to see um, yeah we'll get these cows fed and see if there's anyone around to collect the milk but I think we'll be able to keep the 6-3 on the, the feeder wagon from now on through the winter months because I'm not sure what we're going to have to do so I'll leave that filling up and see if we can get this water turned on. This one shouldn't be frozen. No, that's alright. Uh, what I want to do today is see if we can get this sold. We can. So we've got quite a lot of milk in there today, so we made 50,000 from that. That's really good. Just check how much the cows have got. So they've got about half full in, the, in their. Uh, trough so we can put some um, we can put some more stuff in this mixer wagon and um, that probably can be done tomorrow again tomorrow morning uh, so I guess that's what we'll, we'll do next we we'll park this around here we will hop into the Merlot, which is uh, luckily everything's kept in the shed, so it's fairly good to um, start. We will put that on. It's just one straw, so what I want to do today, and I didn't finish what I was saying, is uh, get this, get this straw in here, um, get that in the barn and get it in the corner there, we'll move those round bars out ok everyone, right, we're back uh, sorry, the camera just sort of had a bit of an issue there and didn't record that last bit so I finished uh, loading up the mix wagon here we'll just move this out of the way it should be fine down here we'll turn off the John Deere and what I said, but the clip got deleted, was we're going to move these round bales out here, which we did. We're going to stack those straw in the corner of this shed here. Um, we'll probably send the drone up for that and see you guys once that's been done. Okay, we're on the last four bales here now. So, we're just very carefully going to put these in. So, it didn't take long at all to put them in there. Oh, they're very wobbly, you have to be careful. Um, but, we just slowly put them in front of this other, other straw here. Now, I put them right over this side because 
Uh, it leaves a gap in the middle. Just in case we wanted to park some machinery in there. So there we go. It should be like that. Uh, these ones are quite far over on the top, but they are not going to fall off, so it's okay. But yeah, I left a gap in the middle. Uh, just in case we wanted to park something in there, we could still get to the straw. Um, we just got to put these last two round bales in here. There we go. But just a little bit of a tidy up this morning on the farm. So that's good. We can just put these here because they get used first because they're the oldest. So we just drop that down there. Perfect. Okay, so just park the uh, Merlo up there. Right, okay. So now we've got the 6 3 there. That's okay. Uh, I'm going to head over to the shop in the 6 9 because I think it's about time that we gave our cows some bedding. So I'm off to go and buy a straw blower. Um, that way we can put some straw in for the cows so they're not just. Um, we'll back up a bit at this gate. So they're not just making slurry so we get some solid manure off them too um, so yeah we'll head out to the shop uh, also I think we will be able to sell our silage bales in the next episode in the next vlog even because uh, they would have probably fermented enough by then which I will take them over with the auto sucker but I'll have to get the merlot over there to put them in the processing uh, units uh, as well so I have to take both machines over uh, so yeah, luckily we're not far away from the shop so um, it's not going to take us long we can see our silage bales down there but the ground's still going to be pretty hard so but tomorrow it should be hard as well we should be able to drive out there and just pick up the rest of our silage. It's not going to get it all done tomorrow probably, but we can make a start. Um, watch out for these cars here. So yes, we will go and speak to them. They should have one in stock, so... can't see any but they probably got one in the shed there so we'll just pull up and park in here there we go looking good and we will go in and speak to them okay guys so I've just been sat here talking to them and it is cost us 25,000 but as you can see we have got a massive straw uh, chopper here. Um, it's certainly fit for what we want to do with it. Um, they just pulled it out here. I don't know if we'll be able to get onto there. We'll have to have a go. Um, but yeah, so they were really quick with it actually. It didn't take long at all. I transferred them over the money and it, that was that. So it's another piece of equipment for the farm, which is good. Don't know, we should be able to get that, but I don't know, we're still quite far away. Maybe there. No, okay. I'll have to figure out a way to move this round. Okay, so we're all hooked on and ready to go. Ready to head back to the farm. Um, and we can try this thing out straight away. We've got some straw, which we just moved in, so. I suppose we should chop up the round bales first since they're sort of in the way. Um, yeah, it should start making, producing us some, some solid manure now, which we will be able to spread on the fields come spring. Uh, so that's the idea of that. It's fairly heavy because it's making the tractor uh, slow up down this, up this hill. lovely view. So yeah, see you guys back at the farm. Here we are pulling in now. 
As you can see, our barley field is coming along good. Uh, we will just put this here. Um, I think we just plop the uh, bales straight into the middle there. We'll give it a go and see how we get on. I think we'll be able to squeeze two brown bales in there at the same time. But we'll find out. This looks like that going alright. Okay, so that's both of them put in there. So we will just try and put this in here. Perfect. Uh, we will hop in 6 9. And we will take this up to the cows. Now, hopefully, they will um, be able to take two bells. I should think they would. Because they haven't had any bedding at all, so we will just go around here and I'm assuming we just drive here and blow it in somewhere around here. Okay, so I think we actually just blow the straw in here. There we go, just putting it over the fence. Looking good. These are some happy cows. You can see the straws being put in here. We'll just hop up and just watch from here. So they have taken all of that straw, which I'm actually quite impressed with. We'll just quickly have a look in the back and see what see what they've used. Yeah, so they've used one bale pretty much. Well, that's good. So now if we check for happiness, they should be fairly good. Yeah, so they take about 3,800 litres of straw. So, perfect. They're going to be happy. We have to, it adds to something. We can do this every day, I guess. Bed down with them. Yeah, I think that's a good buy. Oh, it's a bit bumpy there, but we got over it, right? Okie dokie. So. We'll take this back and pop it in the shed. I'm sure we'll be needing it tomorrow. Just put it in here. I'll turn these beacons off. There's a busy machinery shed in here. So here we go. We we'll just put this here. Fits in okay. Shut that door up. And we will put the 6 free with the feeder wagon away. We'll put that in the shed also. We're going to need this uh, thing. And then tomorrow we can get that silage sold. Uh, just after we fed the cows. So we'll just back this in here. Yeah, I think we've got a fair little bit done today on the yard. Just a bit of a tidy up really. It's good to get these straw indoors before the rain. Uh, we'll just check the weather. So yeah, it's meant to snow Friday. So we only had today to get it done. And tomorrow's meant to be snowing. So hopefully that'll be nice and hard for us to go out and move these silage bales. We'll just see how much time left they've got. So four hours to go until they should be roughly ready. So... Yeah, I think it's just a bit of a shorter episode today, guys, just to um, uh, fill you in on what's been happening. So tomorrow, like I said, we can get some of these silage sold, and at some point we need to sell our oats as well. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>